I just did a video on it and put it on. I'm mad. And uh, I just want to tell you what it was about because that's just how I am. The King of Pentacles came out crossing. Queen of Wands was the end. Magician was right here because I'm usually good on what happened. That was a lot of confusion there. This is because that's where you want to be. Balance is taken. This go here. This like that went there. This could even went there. I think this went there. I think this was over here. And I think this was over here. I think this was over here. I think this was over here. All right. First card that came out was the magician, which is somebody doing a manipulation, doing a spell, doing black magic on you with the Knight of Rods not making something happen. And it's like they doing this black magic and they got you feeling bound and anxiety. You got a lot of stuff going on. But you came across, which is the Taurus, Aries, Capricorn, Virgo energy. And it's like you stuck in a situation because this is where you want to be at this time. And it's like you're wondering like what is going on in your life. You give and take it, but you going through something. Um, it's like you praying, trying to talk to the divine about something. Um, you trying to rest and retreat because you feel like like you can't move past people coming up at you, against you. You can't you can't move past somebody that you may was dealing with um, that want to make something happen. You got a lot of confusion wrapped around you. Choices. You're trying to figure out why is all this happening to you. With the four of wands, you got your marriage fell, your union fell, your engagement fell. So all these cards came out with the clarifier. I These two, I don't, I don't even, I need to see them. Up. So I'm going to leave them alone because that wasn't in the read last time. But it seemed like somebody, you asked somebody to do black magic for you. That's what I'm missing. I'm missing that ace. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You ask somebody, like, your family life is all sad. Like, it's like somebody, you ask somebody to do black magic for you so you could get more money. Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, right? But it seemed like they was doing other shit without you know. They was hiding, and it was like your whole life felt like it's fucked up. It's like, yeah, they gave you abundance, a new beginning in your finances, but they also was doing other shit to you. Without you knowing, like, it's kind of fucked up, but it's like your life is going through all this, these changes because of this person. You paid them for black magic, whatever you did to get more money, yeah, that's coming. That wish is fulfilled, but it was like, uh, it could be a, a Scorpio cancer, but it don't mean they high and something. They was high and that they was doing black magic against you as well. Um, And when I pulled out the card for the Oracle, it said you sexy as fuck. So it could be some, somebody that... That you asked to do black magic to get you more money that's infatuated with you and you just didn't know it. But yeah, they just do they did other black magic and that's why you going through that. So if somebody is going through like um everything in your life is going fucked up. Or you ask somebody to do shit, or you just got a feeling. I know how to take hexes off. I know how to take all that shit off. For a fee. Cause it's work. But, yeah, somebody turned your life upside down because they was doing black magic on you. That's fucked up. After you only wanted a, a black magic for money and they did other shit. Woo. I'm telling you, you got to watch everybody. Peace, light, and blessings.